NAD is the key regulator. It's really the orchestrator, or the maestro of the entire metabolic machinery of the body. So it's absolutely at the center of things and therefore critical for understanding health and disease. So in terms of our longevity, why is it important? And talk about the connection between NAD levels and aging. Well, because NAD is so central to all of our metabolism, to our thinking, to our bodily functions over time, if it declines and it's not available uh, as it should be, as it was when we were younger, there are, of course, changes in our ability to stay alive, to stay fit, to stay active, to remain at the very top of our form. So the fall in NAD as we age is a critical determinant of aging, if not the driver of aging. So essentially it's the root cause. As we think about as we age, we start to deteriorate, you know, metabolism maybe isn't as good. Maybe we're not as strong, harder to put on lean muscle mass, uh, maybe not as sharp as we once were. As we look for the root cause, in your view, NAD plays a critical role here. There are probably a number of root causes, some of which we know now, some of which we'll learn about in the future. But it's fair to say at this point, it's the leading contender, if not the dominant figure in the entire aging process.